Hey friends and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the issue while launching the game Star Wars Battlefront 2. You got a black screen right at the startup. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and directly proceed with the resolution. First of all, you need to head over to settings menu and then click on the option system. Then choose the option display. Scroll down and click on the option graphics. Click on the option change default graphics settings. Now right over here, you will find an option of hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. If this particular option is available, make sure you toggle it off. After doing so, close it. Nextly is you need to disable the in-game overlays. If you are using EA app, launch it, click on three line icon and choose option settings. Click on the option applications, scroll down and you will find the option of in-game overlay. Turn it off. After turning it off, if you are using discord, again go to the settings, type find in-game overlay and toggle it off. Now. If you have NVIDIA GPU, launch the NVIDIA, click on general tab and you will find the option of in-game overlay. Toggle it off. Again, I am telling you to make sure to toggle off all the in-game overlays while launching the game. After doing these two changes, relaunch your game to fix out the black screen issues while launching Battlefront 2. If this failed to work out and if you have an NVIDIA GPU, then you need to downgrade your GPU drivers. Here is the official website. Type in all the details right over here and click on the option start search to find the relevant drivers for your GPU. Then scroll down and you will find a driver version 576.28. Click on this option get download to download these drivers into a PC and once downloaded, install them and then relaunch your game to fix out the issue. If this also failed and if you are using Steam, launch the Steam, right click on your game and choose the option properties. Right in the general tab, you will find the option of launch option. Whatever the value is, delete it and type in minus DX11. Now close it. Now, if you are not using the Steam, you need to add the game to the Steam by clicking on the option add a game and choose add a known Steam game. Now, click on the option browse to browse the directory of the game and once you find the exe file, select it and click on the option open. Once the game is selected, click on the option add selected program. Now, right click on the game, go to properties and launch options, type in dx level. Now, close it. Nextly is you need to open the game settings which is available in this PC, from the left pane, click on the option documents and find Star Wars Battlefront 2. Open it and here open settings folder. First of all here, right click on boot options and choose option open with and click on the option notepad. From here, under the full screen, whatever the value is written, delete in and type in 1. Nextly, windows borderless enable. Delete the value 1 and type in 0. After doing these two changes, your game will start in the full screen mode. Now click on the file menu and choose option save. Same thing you need to do with this particular profile options underscore profile. Right click, open with notepad, press the control F key to search, type in border and hit the enter key. Now you will find the option of windows border enable. Again delete and type in zero, then find full screen mode and over here instead of zero delete and type in one. Once you have done so, Click on the file menu and choose option save. Once you have done these two changes right in these two files, relaunch your game and this will completely fix out the issue of Battlefront 2 black screen at the startup or at the launch. So that's all about it friends. If this video works out for you, I request you to please click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell notification icon to continue receiving updates from my channel. Thank you so much friends. Thank you for watching.